Hey guys, welcome to the episode of Xayblade Plays. The rain has stopped. I'm gonna run out here real quick. Woo! And I'm gonna swim. Like it's no manana. We're gonna get over to this side. We're gonna walk as soon as we get here, though, because uh, obviously we don't want to be wasting all of our energy. And hopefully, yep, those guys did not follow us. Oh man, I tell you what, I should actually have something else on my hotbar, shouldn't I? There we go. I tell you what, guys, it was absolutely crazy. Um, I mean, it wasn't crazy night. It was. It was luckily it wasn't very dark, but I could not actually light anything there because that thing would go up and smoke. Uh, but I will be making another um, little uh, no, uh, totem pole, uh, tower or whatever over here, pointing diagonally, because I did go diagonally to that mountain, because that's where I want people to go. Now, I, I mean, obviously there's really nothing great about that house there. I basically just stayed there because I had to. It was getting too late for me to jump into the water and swim away. Uh, yeah, so that's what I did. Anyway, I'm going to uh, place, probably over on that hill, a uh, little beacon. Ah, that's what it's called, a beacon. Beacon so I can find my way back uh, home, because now I'm going west again. So, I'm going to get way lost when I hit an ocean and be like, where the flip do I need to be? Alright, so let's come up this way. Whoa. That was a bit of lag spike there. I wonder what's going on. Maybe my recording software did something, or maybe something spawned in. I don't know. Anyway. So let's make ourselves the uh, good old tower, and I'll be right back as soon as it's done. Alright guys, I made that little tower, and I put it at diagonal so I know what way to go. And I could probably see that from a distance. It's obviously not too big, um, and we are around an ocean again. So, I mean, we are curbing the ocean side, which is okay. But I do want to check out the entirety of this desert, because we may be far enough away from original spawn. I, that's the problem when you die and you respawn. You don't know if you're heading towards your original spawn location or if you're heading farther away from it. So you've got to like look for everything. You can't just bypass anything because you need to be able to find the, the area. So you might find a temple and realize, oh, actually I'm not far enough away from spawn. Or you might like actually find your way back to your main spawn. Um, instead of finding the things you're looking for. And it doesn't really matter sometimes. Like, my main base has a couple of iron tools, which I would be very thankful for. I would not be complaining if I found that. Um, there is an axe there. There's a pick, an iron pick there, an iron axe. Um, I think that's finished over that way, but I'm just hugging the coastline. Yeah, an iron axe, an iron pick. Um, there's uh, some iron even there that hasn't finished melting. Yeah, there's lots of stuff there for me, guys, so... Oh, and it, that was before the change. Oh, here we go. Look at this. I do want to actually... I want to check out the rest of the desert first before I hit this direction. But, yeah, see the desert ends there. Because this could lead to a plains biome. So we'll check that out as soon as I finish looking at the desert. Anyway, so yeah. There's stuff there that I want. So if I found it, it wouldn't be that bad. But I really want to find diamonds, which is why I'm doing this. So, yeah. Anyway, guys, I'm going to just look around here. Uh, I'll come back if I don't find anything, and we'll head to that forest unless I find something cooler. So, anyway, guys, be right back. All right, guys, there's nothing great on that side. I just started walking over, and um, there's actually just trees. Wrong kind of trees. I want to head towards warmer climates, so I'm just going to go this direction. I think, from memory, we're heading north. That's probably close to that other forest I found and that other desert. So, we didn't even discover that whole entire desert, but I want to head in a different direction. I mean, I found two two temples there. What's the likelihood of finding a third, right? So, Although, maybe if you find two in the same desert, there might be a higher chance of finding a third, because two is actually pretty hard to find as well. Oh, shoot, I didn't actually cook anything either, so I'm going to have to eat some of the pork that I was saving. Nothing I can do about that. Anyway... So we're going to keep going in this direction. Hopefully we find some good stuff. This is really far west. Um, and it looks like... Ooh, this does... Uh, it does continue to a plains biome like I was hoping for. I think that's a plains biome. It might just be an open section. I don't know. But it's definitely an area that I want to... Ooh, ow. Check out more of. And I'm going to grab some wood on the way. I have 33, but... Uh, I'm going to be cooking a bunch of my food again when I stop next time. I wasn't able to do it again because I was in a wood house with witches all around me. And I didn't want to burn the place down and have them throwing all sorts of potions at me. So, But luckily it wasn't a very dark night. Otherwise it would have been uh, really rough. So anyway, I'm going to have a little poke around here. Get some mushrooms. And uh, yeah, I'll be right back with you guys. 
too. This place is pretty lush, guys. Look at all this food. Um, and there's cows, there's sheep. I am, like, just literally killing it. Get these. Haha, <laughs> yeah, I got them angry. They killed one chicken. Hopefully they killed a second chicken. I thought they killed two. Anyway. So, ooh, what's this over here? Ooh. Don't get too close. I don't want to get kicked, but... That's nice. That is nice. We're going to keep continuing this way. And, uh... Hopefully we can find a village. Would be nice. And this is a plains biome. Lots of sheep. How much sheep meat? I have lots of sheep meat. And lots of sheep pelts. But we're going to... Anyway, we're going to keep heading this direction. Oh, okay. This direction. <laughs> and I'll be back as soon as we find anything interesting. Alright, guys. We have hit another ocean. Another friggin' ocean. Okay, we're going to follow it again north because we've been heading north and west. Um, oh, wait, 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 wait. Before I do that, I want to point in the direction that I need to go. So when I'm going this direction... I know where I'm going, so I'm just going to come up here and make myself another one of those little totems. Oh, I don't have a lot of cobblestone left. There we go, that's the direction. So at least when I'm coming down this way, I should find it. Oh, look, there's actually uh, more stuff over that way. Very interesting. All right, so I'll be back in just a bit if I find anything interesting. Hey, guys, I found a dog. I am going to uh, try to make him my friend. Yes, because he's going to help me with my uh, killing. All right, and he'll also keep me protected while I come out this way. Uh, is my thinking, anyway. All right, what do we got over this way? More sheep. Oh, shoot, doggy. We're going to have to... Uh... <gasps> Village. Okay, okay. Um, No, no. Don't want that loaded. Do not want that loaded. Come on, doggy. We found a village. It's turning nighttime. We don't want that loaded. We're coming down this way. Uh, I've got plenty of food now, so I actually could afford a dog. We're coming way this way. We do not want anything to ruin that village. So let's just... Um, let's just dig in here. Come on, boy. What are you waiting for? Invitation? Come on inside. I'll have to sit him down when he comes inside so I don't burn because I want to. I do want to actually make some uh, stuff. Now, this village, it might be a populated village. We may be far enough away. So, if it isn't, then that means I may actually be heading towards my. Oh, shoot. It's turning dark. Dog, come here, please. Okay, we're hitting gloom. It's a dark night. Hopefully it's not too dark. I need to make myself one of these. Oh, no. I need to actually, actually, I need to make myself a new bow drill. Alright, what can I get rid of? I'll just uh, get rid of you for now and place you down. And, ah, uh, not there. I can barely see, but I can tell that it's the wrong spot. There we go. Okay, now let's light this thing. <clears throat> Alright, I'm going to light this thing, hopefully get the dog in here, and be right back. Alright guys, I managed to get the dog in here. He is in the dark for whatever reason, but uh, he's here, so I am thankful for that. Let's get this fire going and see what we can get from it. I don't know why I'm actually keeping the sharp stone on me. Wasted space, but whatever. Anyway, I'm going to keep this fire going, and I'm going to cook some food, and I'll see you guys in the morning, and we're going to finally get ourselves a village. Hopefully it's a real one. Uh, that's why I came all the way down here. Nothing should have attacked it. Although I do need to be careful because there will be um, several zombie type dudes there. Which, I know, it is annoying because at the same time, I don't have any way to actually convert them. So I'm going to have to go a lot further away. But hopefully I'll get my first piece of wheat and maybe some seeds. You guys, see you in a bit. Cheers. All right, guys, it is morning time. Come here, doggy. You're gonna come with me. Um, I'll leave that here. I probably never will use it again. And this guy's gonna try to shoot me. I know. Oh, wrong thing. There we go. All right, so we are going to inspect this village now. Hopefully, it's far enough away from our original spawn, which I still don't have an idea. If I know that it's far enough away, then I can actually guess 
which direction our original base is at. Right? If this is a fully fledged one. Oh, shoot. There's things that have died out here. Okay. Is it a full one? or It's a partially. All right. So I know that in some way, shape, or form, I am far enough away. Are there windows and doors? There are windows and doors. This is a full-fledged zombie village. Crap. And they don't burn in the sun either. All right. So this is dangerous. Dag nabbit. Okay. Um... Oh! Oh, he's... Nope, nope. He's, he's, he's a zombie. He's a zombie. Oh, he's a zombie. Okay. We're gonna have to try to kill this guy. Get him. Get him, dog. Holy crap. He is... He is... Okay. Right. So... Problem. Uh, they're all zombified. Now, I do know that there have been some changes. I don't know if... Every single one of them is going to be zombified. But um, I th I'm pretty sure... For what did I just pick up? I don't even know. I'm pretty sure... Are these burned out torches? They're burned out torches. Dagnabbit. Okay. Oh, we still don't have a thing. Alright, well... There's really nothing worth anything here because there's no chests. But that's okay. Beca ooh. Because what is worth something are these things, right? The wheat. This is what we've been looking for. Alright, so let's see. Um, okay, let's get rid of some rock. And let's just plow through the seeds here. Just be careful because I do know there's another one around here somewhere. Now, this is the closest one to my base. It is sad that... Um, they're all zombified. Now, I think that's just going to be the case from here on out. I don't think there are non-infected villages. I think uh, Flower Child has made them all to be infected. Now, I'm getting as many seeds as I can. I can get 64. I am kind of avoiding the wheat. Just because um, I don't have enough room for it. But I think I will. I will probably pick it up anyway. What do I throw out? You know what? I've got plenty of wool. But now that I have this... Ooh, I don't like that dog looking at me. Now that... Oh, am I... I've already got... I've already got 64. Let's check that out. I got those at home. Ready? Uh, doggy. Alright. Let's pick up the rest of this. We are not leaving any of it here. This place is dead to me because... Like Flower Child says, as soon as you've visited one of these places, uh, those guys will die. So when I leave here, they'll disappear. Which kind of sucks, because, I mean, the game has changed since he enabled that. Like, the original point was to, to get you to think twice about coming, and to make it so that you don't get villagers right away. But the fact that you really need wheat and things to be... Oh, wow. I've got another 64. Uh, get rid of that stuff. But the, the fact that I've got another... Uh, ooh, there he is. Uh, what am I saying? Yeah, the fact that you need wheat to get, and villages to get stuff, you know, um, makes it so that it's... Yeah, it's sad that that has to happen. Okay, so we found our village. Um, we're going to head back this way. Uh, we... If, I think if we head west, we should get to that. Um, when we went north last time, we found a really big, uh, a really big desert. So I'm thinking that we may actually come. Oh wow, we've actually got to go back. To, we may actually come to the desert. Come back to the desert. So I want to head back this direction, and I want to head towards. Um, oh wow. Oh, doggy, doggy, you just pooped. What did you eat? I don't remember feeding you. He probably ate something the other day. Hopefully it wasn't anything that would cause him to turn crazy. Uh, what do I throw out? Daggummit. Um, what do I throw? What do I throw? What do I throw? Uh, oh, 
Hold on a second, guys. All right, I'm going to throw the bow drill because I have plenty of string. <laughs> I'll have to make another one. But, uh, yeah, I really don't want to get rid of anything. I really wanted the poop. Poop is not that common of a thing for me because, obviously, I don't have dogs. I have one now. I don't know if I'll be able to feed him. I may actually have to kill him. But at least while we're running around here, he can, uh, he can eat some chicken. Wait. There you go. Finish him off. Did he eat it? He didn't eat it. Okay. I guess he's still full from what he ate the other day. Anyway, so we're going to head back now, um, all the way back to our base. I think that was a pretty good, um, adventure. But, uh, yeah, so I want to head towards the, the desert if I can. Or should I just make that? Hmm. So, my thinking is this. Everywhere east of here had been abandoned. Now, I did go north. So, no, but I was going north previously, just straight north. And I went northeast. And going northeast led me to this area. Right? That was, sorry, northwest. That was northwest. I went northwest to here. Um, and going north, straight north, I was finding abandoned places, and I was also finding spawn points. Oh, shoot. Flipping dogs. So, yeah, I was finding abandoned spots north. So my thinking is, if I head west, I'm going farther away from spawn. So if I head east, I should be getting closer to spawn. So my current base, where I am now, actually might be close. Oh, my word, I keep going around in circles actually might be close what is this desert is this the northern no 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 i think i remember mm. well obviously i was here look i cut down a tree yeah okay anyway so if i go when i was going north straight i was oh my word i'm ah. all right guys i'm back sorry i cut a lot of stuff out here so when i went north i uh I found nothing, right? It was all abandoned. When I went when I went west, it was all abandoned until this point, right? So that means that I actually must be pretty close to my original spawn at my new base. So I'm thinking it's either further east from where I am or further south from where I am because we went northwest and that's where we found the village over there. And that's northwest. Sunset Sunsets in the west. Northeast. Sorry, northeast. We went east. So further east we went, we actually found a full-fledged village with villagers all dead. But we found a full-fledged village. So that means if I continue going north, I should also find more things. But that means that my current base is actually close to my original spawn. Oh shoot, I'm hungry. So that's really good news for us. Because it means that I don't need to... Uh, that I could actually find my base if I head east. I'm thinking my base must be east based upon my uh, calculations thus far. Uh, okay, yep, there's that, uh, the place we stayed. And it is becoming nighttime, so we will need to, whoop, get down here real quick. And I think we can actually, yeah, here we go. Uh, do I have a pick? I do. And I don't really have room for anything. So we're just going to dig into here and spend the night with my poor little pooch. Oh, come on. Right. Oh, is it a dark is it a dark night? It's a dark night. It's a dark night. <sighs> come on, break. Okay, so what I'm going to do is Oh, shoot. <laughs> well, guys, I'm going to die now that I have a dog. Come on, come on, come on. Break already. There we go. Okay, so that's good. What I'll do is I'll make one of these. Oh, that was the dog. Alright, let's uh, 
build another bow drill quick. Hopefully this is it. I can't really see. It is. It is. It is. Okay. Awesome. All right. Let's uh, finish getting in here. Holy crap. That was close. Um, wow. All right. So I'm going to... Uh, I don't know what I'm going to do. That poor dog. He's going to die because he's going to burn or something's going to kill him. Yep. Oh, sorry, dog. Please don't die. No! Oh, you dumb dog. Such a flippin' dumb dog. Oh, my word. Come on in here. Come on in here. I just threw out... Oh, my word. I threw everything out. my shovel. Hi, Dad. Hey, how are you? Good. Well, guys, we lost the dog. I accidentally suffocated him. <laughs> I tried to get him in here, but he just wouldn't listen. But it's okay. It's not like we had the room for him anyway. Um, I'm going to eat these cooked pork chops because I've got 16 more that I can use for eggs, and I don't really feel like cooking. So I'm going to meet you guys back at base. And like I said previously, it's... Um, uh, I I'm going to make another scale north and I want to go east because I want to see if I can find my location. Now again, we're talking about a thousand block location. Uh, 1500 blocks where things won't spawn, but at least I know where things will spawn. And there was a spot close by where things didn't spawn. So I can gauge that there's, well there's probably about 500 blocks, but still I can gauge about where I am and I can think, well, if I'm up into the east, then that means my base must be down into the west, or to the west, or to the south. So there's the bottom quadrant I can look at. I don't know. It means that I'm not as far away as I thought it was. But then again, you never really are, are you, <laughs> when you spawn. But now I might be. Like, if I spawn now, I could spawn anywhere randomly in a very far block radius. So I better not die now. You guys, I'll meet you guys back at my base unless something different happens. So cheers. Hey guys, um, I'm back safe. I've been cooking up my food, uh, which has been nice actually. I've been enjoying it. There's tons of food. I've also set up the, uh, uh, what am I thinking? Um, oh, I don't have anything in there. I've also set up the uh, farm to have a couple of things of um, wheat. So that's awesome. And wow, I have so many seeds. Uh, the chickens are going to be laying eggs like crazy. So we should hopefully build our chicken population. Eggs. Everything. It's going to be wonderful. It's going to be so wonderful. Uh, what we have here. Yeah, so I've got lots of sandwiches now. I've been grinding up the wheat uh, to make myself some bread. Which has been well worth it. I've got a fair bit of wheat left in there. Um, I may use it to get some animals out this way. So that I could breed them. Maybe pigs. Don't know. It doesn't really matter. I have wheat now so I can grind that puppy up. Uh, to make some good stuff. Anyway, uh, so I'm just going to sit here and cook this stuff, but I hope you enjoyed this episode. Please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe uh, for more content. If you liked it, subscribe. Why not? Anyway, guys, I'm going to keep cooking, and I'll see you guys next time. Cheers.